Hey everybody, happy Halloween from Guardline Security. Uh, I'm Dave, I'm the Chief Operating Officer here at Guardline and uh, I wanted to take some time to find some innovative ways to use our wireless motion detectors um, to uh, make Halloween a lot more fun this year. So we're going to take this pumpkin and we're going to carve it uh, and then we're going to sit it out on the porch. Uh, we're going to put a light inside the pumpkin and then we're going to connect a motion detector to it so anytime someone walks by the property it's going to go off. Uh, now you have to excuse me, I'm, I don't really enjoy being on camera, I usually leave that to the other guys so um, today we're having a uh, Fremont Bonfire Brown Ale from our friends here at the Fremont Brewery in Seattle. Um, and uh, we're going to take some tools here, I've got some power tools uh, to get carving. We're not going to use any of the scoops or scrapes or do any of that work. So um, let's go ahead and get to work. All right. All right, so we've got our jack-o'-lantern carved, and let's go ahead and get it up on the porch. We'll put a light inside it, wire that to a 12-volt uh, relay in the back of a receiver, and then we'll set up a motion detector. We'll get everything set up so when someone walks by your property, the light in this jack-o'-lantern is gonna go off. All right, everybody, we're in my shop here, and I've got my jack-o'-lantern. And uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take the top off, and we're gonna take this strobe light. The strobe light is uh, available on GuardlineSecurity.com and we're going to place it inside the pumpkin. And as you can see, I've carved a little hole in the back here to uh, allow us to thread through um, and get the wiring for the strobe out of the pumpkin. Alright, now we're going to get the, any pumpkin-y stuff I have on these copper wires off. Alright. And now what we're going to do is we're going to put these into the back of a guard line, security, driveway line. So on the back of your guard line you'll see you have a space for a 12 volt relay, which is what this strobe uses. So we'll go ahead and hook this in. Alright, when you do that, make sure your dip switches are pressed right. So dip switch 5 in the up position will convert over to the relay. And then dip switches 3 and 4, I put those into a 10 second uh, delay, which means to keep the uh, 12 volt relay open. The factory settings on our guard line are 1 second, so that would mean you get one flash and then it'd be over. We want it to go significantly longer, so we want to go 10 seconds. So once we've done that, we would go ahead and test that the light's coming on. Here, I'll show you that. We'll set off the guard line. Perfect. So we're getting a great flash. That's exactly what I want in my, uh, in my pumpkin here. So let's go ahead and put all this stuff together and we'll put it out on the porch. We'll get ready to go. All right, we are going to test this out. We have the uh, receiver set to zero volume so it won't chime. We've got the everything set up, so we're just going to motion over the sensor and see if this works for us and the jack-o'-lantern lights up. Alright, perfect. Happy Halloween from Guardline. 